Good morning sheep fans, Cammy's the name, sheep's the game, it is another miserable day here in the west coast of Scotland, but we've got something a little bit unusual to do today. In today's video I'm shearing Ryland sheep, which are another very interesting breed, very cute breed, maybe up there competing with the Valley Blacknose. So if you're new to the channel, or maybe you've been a few times, we're heading towards that 50,000 mark, so click that subscribe button and then just sit back and enjoy the video. Okay, so we are here with, I take it it is Abby and Amy's flock. We're going with, yes, your flock girls. We're here with Abby and Amy at their uh, bar. Here, bar slash sheep shed. Fantastic, not a thing you see very often, I must say. I rather like it. We did have some nice music playing as well. But due to YouTube and things, you know, I put the music off. So you've just got me to listen to. We're going to scan the sheep first, see what's in lamb, and anything that's in lamb is going to be shown and they're going to stay in the shed now until lambing time. Of course, anything that's not in lamb will be going back out to the field, so we don't want to shear it. So yeah, we're kind of set up. I'm just going to go and plug in the scanner, get my glove on. The team here are going to work hard to bring the sheep round. Or it'll be a doddle, I'm sure. It'll be a doddle. And we'll, we'll see if there's any lambs in them. Right. Damage there, hopefully. As long as I can see past my GoPro there, we'll be okay. Right, right, so your first shin's in lamb. Good start. And that is a single. Just for. Oh! We've got one in behind us here, but just for anyone looking, try to work out what's what. We've got a body at 12 o'clock right now. I think we can see that okay. And then a head. That's a head at 12, body at just after 12, head just before 12, body just after there. Are you marking them or are you just writing it down? No, just writing it down. That's a one. No, oh, that's not quite marking them because you're going to shoot them, forgot about that. This is number 36, so again, you guys are seen on the screen somewhere at the side. This has all been played together, so hopefully my audio's okay here. You can hear me, and we'll do more of it, scanning videos, but I thought first one of the season, everyone loves to see the screen and see what I'm seeing, so at the moment we're seeing a body at 12 o'clock there, or just before 12, and then if I come through the head, it's just after 12, and that's all there is there, and that's a good, well-developed lamb. And the way you tell the age is you look at a cross-section of the body, so... Hopefully my finger's okay and you can see what I'm pointing at here. But there's the body there. So you take a cross section of that and you look at these wee circles up the corner here. So we're going to say that's about 70 odd days. 75 days, say something like that for that lamb. And that's a single again. Number 40. Number 34's in now. And I, this is a, a, a bigger lamb, so hopefully that actually makes it a lot easier for you guys to see. If you look there, I'm leaning over a little bit because I'm looking over my, <laughs> my GoPro. But at 12 o'clock there, you can actually see that lamb really well. Wait till I just got another little go at it there. So, if I fully explain what you're seeing there, if you look at the wee black dots, in fact, I'm not going to put my finger on the screen, I'll use an arrow because my finger's not that accurate. If you look at little black dots there, in the middle of that body, that's like, where the, the heart is, and if I could just hold it a bit steadier, 
you can actually see the heart flickering. What I'm going to do is zoom in, give me a second. So, I'm not going to use my finger because it's too small an area to point out. And to be fair, um, it would help if I'd zoomed in instead of zooming out. So that, it's not really showing you very well to be fair, but I can see a little flickering. I don't know if the GoPro is going to be good enough to pick that up. But that, where the arrow is pointed just now, that's the heart. And the head, that's the, the bones of the neck. Keep my finger out of the way. That's the bones of the neck travelling up to the head. Up there, and it's quite a well developed lamb. That'll probably be nearer the 80 days. That lamb. And again, it's another single. And this one's not as far on, but it's a similar story, it's a single. So I work away just like that and scan the rest of these sheep. Once that's done, we shear the ones that are in lamb. In fact, let's just skip the shearing because we've done so much of that this summer and go to the roundup. So, I skipped the shearing part there for you because I know you've seen plenty of shearing this summer. Hopefully you enjoyed that little take on the scanning. If you did, big one, let me know in the comments because we, ca we can do that more often when I'm scanning. I'm not saying it's right, I'm just saying that's what I think is there. You know, if any, if any good scanners are watching and you want to keep me right, let me know because I can let everyone here know the actual answer. Anyway, we are get finished, we're going to pack up here. Um, yeah, and that's it really, there's, there's nothing much else happening. What can I get for you, Callie? Magic, I'll take a famous grouse, thanks. That's it for this one, sheep fans. We'll see you for the next one.